Well, welcome to this week on Let's Fix Her Up. I am Mike Jamison and uh, Mike Jamison 2.0. It's, it's been a wild ride here in the last month or so. Had our surgery about a week or so ago. We're feeling pretty good right now. All the well wishes, thank you so much. Uh, I, I, tell, I say this to everybody, if you're 50 years old, don't do what I did. I didn't go to the doctor for 20 plus years. And, uh, and then all of this stuff kind of crept up on me. Go to your doctor, make sure if you're not feeling good, you know, and uh, it's, uh, it's gonna be an effort to get me back to good old Mike Jameson, but uh, the doctors over at the Toledo Clinic uh, did a real nice job and uh, did it quickly and got us back rocking and rolling here. So now we're gonna have a ton of new shows here with Let's Fix Her Up. And of course, we're here starting everything off over at Gladio, do it best on Navarre Avenue. Uh, springtime, a lot of good things are gonna be happening here. And uh, we're gonna be talking to people about these babies right here in just a couple of minutes, the Cub Cadets. They've got them out here at uh, Gladio right now. We're also going to be talking a little bit uh, about some dog foods and things like that for your dogs. We want to make sure they're all taken care of here as springtime comes. And uh, we'll be talking with Lee and Ronnie. We'll be talking to everybody. Plus, we're going to go over to Dan R's. Uh, you know, everybody and their brothers having pothole problems right now. And uh, they're, they're actually putting in a whole new front assembly and a whole, whole front suspension. And because somebody hit one of those big, beautiful potholes, probably out there on I-280 or on uh, I-75. So big show this week. You uh, stick around and uh, we're going to get it all set up for you. One of the great things about Gladio is they're always expanding, kind of like my waistline here. And Trent, how you doing, buddy? Good. How you, you doing, Gamble? I see. I see you got a little some yellow Cub Cadets yes. here now. What happened here? Yes, Them are we nice. Do. Well, actually, there have been multiple manufacturers coming in, approaching us about expanding our line. We did a lot of research, and what we found out, the Cub Cadet has a lot to offer. Uh, there aren't a lot of dealers around. As a matter of fact, we're the newest dealer in all of Ohio, probably, oh, let wow. alone Northwest Ohio. And with the product line they had, we looked at it, some opportunity to give some people, customer-wise, more you know more choices, which is always better. Oh. Like you said, we're expanding. We're yeah, not, we're not getting rid of anything. We're just getting bigger and bigger and better every day. And with our first airing of this, uh, obviously, we're looking right at the beginning of spring here, uh, uh, middle of March here now. And I, I know you got some great deals and stuff with these. I mean, you know, for me, this is probably all I need, but unfortunately, sure. with my pacemaker now, I can't even sit on one of these now. It's bumming me out. But, uh, but I mean, you've got just such a v variety here and up the, the big monster, and I'm sure you can even get bigger than this. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yes, there is bigger than that. You can put blades on them, snow, snow throwers. Uh, pull behind, you know, accessories, so on and so forth, but you can get bigger than that. That is second to the biggest that they offer as far as a machine goes. Cub Cadet, what, what sets the Cub Cadet apart from some of the other units? I mean, I see some things, you know, that looking at some of the other machines that we've looked at over the years where, uh, you know, like with your deck height and stuff, just so many more you know, you've got, you, you know, you got 10, 10 different Absolutely. settings here where you don't see that yeah, with some of the others. Yeah, you've got a lot of choices, so you can tailor-made whatever you want your lawn to look like, keep it consistent that way. Uh, as far as the machine itself, it's comfortable, it's easy to run, it's efficient, it's powerful, and their price really is attractive. They are, they are very positioned very well in the market price point-wise for the residential tractor series is what we have here. Now we've got bigger, we go all the way up to commercial zero turns, of course, um, until it gets a little warmer, we won't right, have right, those right. inside here. Sure. And we actually, they also have a line of UTVs, like off-road four-wheelers. Very we nice. We are going to be a full-service dealer for those, too, and there aren't many of them around in this area. i got to do this. Uh, Dave, I want to have my, have my cameraman come over here. We're going to pop the hood on this thing. This, this just, here, you want to get down over on this side, Dave. Yeah, this is... Uh, that is the biggest exhaust. Look at the exhaust on this monster. Yeah, everybody it's like a V8, comments. man. Looks like a small engine, a small car engine underneath the hood there. You can see that's a Kohler powered engine, um, you know, 
just fantastically engineered. You know, that's a big tractor and it needs a, a, a big engine to do a big job and that fulfills all those needs and like I said, at a surprisingly affordable price. You know, try, we, we talked about this before too and, and for somebody that's got, you know, a, a fairly good size yard, mm -hmm. Um, and, and that's one of the things Gladio is always good at. I mean, if the people come out here, they want to buy one of these, you go out there and look at it and say, you know, this is the model I think oh, you might absolutely. need. Absolutely. You, you, you don't want to go here. You don't need this model. Right. I mean, obviously, every guy in America wants sure. this model right sure. here. You know, that's the beast. But, uh, but with this, you're going to be able to do what you need to do. And uh, the, the, main, the main thing, I think, with everybody is getting the consistency now of making sure that lawn looks good. And Cub Cadet's going to be able to do that. Absolutely. Yep, and we are a full service dealer, parts, sales, and service. It's not like some of your places where you buy it and you have a problem, you go back and they point the finger you know, to another shop. Exactly. You know, we're all about service here. You know that. You've been oh, around yeah. long enough. Well, that's the one thing, and that's always been one of the reasons why, you know, we did Let's Fix Her Up. You know, it's yes. local. It's all about things that are happening locally here in Toledo, Oregon, you know, Lake Erie, everything. Obviously, I'm prevy to the east side. I love sure. the east side. I'd do anything for anybody over here. And, uh, and I just think you guys have it. And, and we want to make sure everybody knows that you still have all of the different. Absolutely. You, you're still Husqvarna. Absolutely. You're, you still have all of the others Husqvarna, here. Husqvarna, Xmark, Steel, full service sales and parts. Um, and it's our 80th birthday this year. So, well, you don't look a day over 68. Know, well, you know that's a, that's youth. <laughs> it just is a genetic thing with me. See, I see how it is. You know, the good-looking people get better looking <laughs> as they get older, and then you know, see how it goes. Thank you, sir. Thanks. We appreciate <laughs> it. <laughs>your roof past its peak it's not always this easy to tell from rooftops to foundations seagate is a trusted a plus bbb accredited business and a platinum preferred contractor as a platinum preferred contractor we offer one of the country's best roofing warranties the owens corning true protection 50-year warranty that's material and labor we've earned your trust for over 30 years toledo call seagate now Tires play an important role in your vehicle's handling, comfort, and fuel efficiency. So when it comes to maintaining them, you need a name you can trust. At Dan Ars Automotive, our expert staff will help you find the perfect tires to keep your vehicle at peak performance. We have a huge selection of top brand tires for you to choose from. Having issues with your tires? We'll diagnose the problem and get you back on the road. Visit Dan Ars Automotive today for tires from a name you can trust. From the kitchens of Italy to you, Arturo's Pizza Kitchen is the home of authentic Italian food. As one of the oldest independently owned pizzerias in Toledo, Arturo's Pizza Kitchen has been serving since 1988. With pizza, salads, award-winning subs, chicken chunks and wings, mom's own lasagna recipe, and our famous cheese sticks, we have it all. Never frozen, always homemade. Arturo's Pizza Kitchen. Hungry? Call Arturo's, 419-698-1641. Well, folks, we're here with Lee Max, and uh, did I say that right? Yeah. Okay, I know I did. Lee, Lee has been around Gladio for years upon years, and this spring is the spring. You know, last year I got a bunch of uh, paint 
to paint my bedrooms and all of that, and I still haven't done it. That paint should still be good, but I should have it come in and have it mixed yes. again, right? Bring it in, and we'll shake it up real good for you. And get it all and get it all set up. Make sure there's no scum on the top of it. No, 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 nothing. Mm -hmm. It's uh, it's just been sitting in my bedroom, and I well, I got sick, you know. Mm -hmm. So now we want to start working on those kind of things. But uh, you know, this is the stupidest question ever. But you you probably you get this question every day. Like, if you're gonna, what's the different styles of paint you want to use? whether it's uh, we're in a, a bathroom or we're going to be in a kitchen or we're going to be in a bedroom. I mean, do you use the eggshell? Do you use the, you know, you know, that's always gotten me, kind of screwed me up. Normally at a bathroom or a kitchen, you use a semi-gloss. Okay. Uh, so it's easier to wipe off, right? Clean up. Much easier to clean. Gotcha. Uh, and in a bathroom, I recommend using a fungicide in it or mildew side. Okay. Also in the kitchen, uh, if you're in a lot of moisture area, mildew side is not going to hurt it. Is that something new? I mean, no. I mean, it, it, they've always had something like been this. Her, been here for years. It's a small additive you add. You can also buy paint with it already in it. But you guys can do that. You can oh, yeah. add it in for paint. See, that's yeah. a cool thing. We can add it into any of our paints. Uh, kitchen, I say semi-gloss. Most of it is going to be personal preference on what you like. Uh, bedrooms, I like a flat because flat. it's a soft finish. Okay. Uh, living room, here again. I like a flat, but that's my personal preference. Sure, sure, sure. Uh, a lot of people like to use semi-gloss or a satin. For a simple reason, it's a lot easier to clean. Uh, right. A den or a playroom where kids get in, mess up the walls, you want to go into a semi-gloss or a satin at least. Gotcha. Because it's going to clean a lot easier. Flat paint has a tendency to absorb dirt when you wash it. I washed windows and walls for quite a few years <laughs> and we ran into fire jobs where you could not wash it. You had to wash it, but then you had to paint it. Gotcha. So oh. it went right into the paint. All right, now here's my big question. I want to, my back uh, back room or family room type thing, uh, I want to go that barn red color because we're going we're gonna to put in some old barn siding on one of the walls mm -hmm. and everything. And I want that, that, that barn red and then the white accents we're going to put on. Is there, do I need to put in a, uh, a separate type of primer before I do a deep dark paint like that? Normally when we bring it up on a computer and we pick the color you want, it'll tell you to prime the base in a gray or a base color. Okay. That way you're going to get much better coverage on this final coat. But you're probably going to have to put m much more coats than you're normally used to with the color like... If you don't like prime it. If you prime it, it should cover one coat. Oh, gosh, those are the kind of things I need. Uh, I know with spring coming here, uh, you're, you're going to be having everybody hitting you up to get... Do you, do you paint? You go out there and paint? No? Them days are over. I'm too huh? old for that. You're too old for that? <laughs> <laughs> well, he just sits here and does his job, and he does a real good job with it, and uh, make sure you can get all of your painting needs done. Any color, anything you need, uh, Gladio has it right out here for you. Sure and, is. you know, we've been a part of this, and Ronnie's been a dear friend of mine for uh, many, many, many years. I, I think it's the hands-on that you guys do out here that's just thumbs up above uh, some of the other stores in town, and you, you, you come out here and you, got, you get it fixed. Well, we try. That's for sure. <laughs> we try. All right, I'm going to bring that paint out here, and then I'm going to we're going to set up for that uh, beautiful barn red in my uh, my back room, which my back room is really super small. But I figure barn red, and then get some of that old barn siding to do one wall. I think it's going to look good. Thank you, sir. Mm -hmm. Have a good one, Jamal. Hey, it's Bob France. Are your clubs cleaned up and ready to go? Then let's talk about Brandywine, the only all-inclusive private country club in Northwest Ohio. You know, people are always taking all-inclusive vacations to save money. Well, at Brandywine, you're on a constant all-inclusive vacation. Unlimited golf, cart, pool, fitness, and all the social events, including the amazing pool parties. It's so refreshing to play a private club where there's no surprises. The new Brandywine Country Club, featuring 18 holes of Arthur Hills Design Championship Golf on a layout that is spectacular. Par 72 now, three par fives on the front 
of nine, total yardage of 66.39. A challenge for great golfers, but fun and playable for the rest of us too. And one of the best things about joining the all-inclusive private Brandywine Club is that you never have to wait for leagues to get out of your way because there's only one league at Brandywine, yours. And don't forget about the amazing restaurant. Champions Bar and Grill reopened in the summer of last year and is now open to the public. Call 419-865-2393 for all the details. And if you join by May 31st, they'll waive the initiation fee. Join me on the course and at the club this year at the all-new, all-inclusive Brandywine Country Club. When the power goes out, your life is disrupted. Heat, air conditioning, refrigeration, phones, all gone. Want to take back control? A Generac Home Standby Generator protects your home against power outages every second of every day, all year long, automatically, whether you're home or away. Control your power, control your life with a Generac Home Standby Generator. For a free estimate, call Schneider Sons Electric. 419-691-8284. From the kitchens of Italy to you, Arturo's Pizza Kitchen is the home of authentic Italian food. As one of the oldest independently owned pizzerias in Toledo, Arturo's Pizza Kitchen has been serving since 1988. With pizza, salads, award-winning subs, chicken chunks and wings, mom's own lasagna recipe, and our famous cheese sticks, we have it all. Never frozen, always homemade. Arturo's Pizza Kitchen. Hungry? Call Arturo's, 419-698-1641. Hey, Mortgage Marty here. With the uh, new tax code changes, home equity lines of credit, HELOCs as we call them, have changed whether they're deductible. And with recent interest rate increases, you're seeing those variable rates on them increase. I had a lot of interest in customers putting them in with their first mortgage, converting to a 10, 15, even 20 year to compress the timeline so they're not stretching back out over 30 and get better rates. If you have interest in that, uh, just text HELOC to the number you see on the screen there, H-E-L-O-C, and we'll get you info on how to take advantage uh, of that tax deductibility all over again. Well, folks, we're here with Janet McAtee. I like that name. That's Thank like you. Bob McAtee, you know. I'm, you know, I'm always thinking sports. I'm always thinking sports. I don't know who that is, but that's okay. Th that's good. Yeah, you're a good girl. You're a good girl. And Janet, you uh, you uh, make everything work here with our, our dog foods and our cat foods, and uh, uh, we're going to talk a little bit about that. Of course, uh, bird feeders and things like that, because my cats sit by my front window when I feed that bird feeder oh, and yeah. just sit there and look at the birds, and, the, and I get hundreds of them, you know, but uh, that's the inter interesting stuff. But, you know, you've been hearing over the last few weeks and the uh, last couple of years that, you know, some of these uh, dog foods, uh, th all these recalls, what's this all about? Well, there's some uh, wisteria, salmonella kind of contamination going on, and um, I know a lot of people are getting scared about that. Um, even low levels can be detrimental to a dog. Definitely. Um, you know, so people are, are starting to get a little more in touch with what exactly is in the foods, which they should be. Sure. You know, I mean, your your pet is, is your baby. I mean, I know with my dogs, they're, they're like my children, so I want to make sure that they're eating as healthy as I am. Um, and so they're starting to look at companies that have a reputation for uh, a good solid uh, line for their foods, mm -hmm. um, ones that don't have recalls as an American made. Um, and that can even be a little tricky because sometimes they'll say American made, but is it American sourced? Gotcha. So, you know, it's important to know what you're putting in your dog's body. Well, come on, let's, let's go over here. I mean, just, just over here with all of your dog foods and the stuff you got. Now, to be honest, I mean, it can get expensive. Correct. It really can, but let's face it, this is your dog. Right. And, uh, and, and from an expensive stand, I would much rather pay for the food than pay the veterinarians because like they get the, the, their stomachs yeah. turn and everything like Absolutely. that with some of the foods. Absolutely. And, and so you guys just have such a great variety. It's incredible. Well, from is a good line. I, I actually have three dogs. One of them I do feed from. I have a, a baby boxer who's about nine months old and we've struggled with some of his digestion issues. Um, and Fram was one of them that worked very well for us. Fram, I met with Fram. I uh, didn't know much about it when I first started selling it, and uh, met with the Fram rep, and, and we really went through explanation of this. Fram uh, company in general is a wealth of information. There isn't one particular one that works for every dog. But the nice thing about Fram is that it's made so that you have that particular dog that. 
um, doesn't want to have just beef one day or right. doesn't want to have salmon. So you can rotate that out a little bit. Um, but their, their foods are um, very palatable for the dog. And uh, it's, it's a whole, we have a grain type, grain free type, and then we also have a regular line. Grains aren't always a bad thing for dogs. Um, usually you'll see a grain intolerance as they get older. Um, and wow, sometimes I saw, that's I didn't not. Know that. Sometimes, you know, I, I believe without having testing done, you don't really know. And the testing in itself can be a couple thousand dollars to, uh, to test your dog to find out if he's grain intolerant or product intolerant. So, you know, you kind of um, do the um, elimination mm -hmm. process and you just kind of experiment with which one works for you. Boy, and I'll tell you, you've got so many different different varieties here and you can just sit down and talk with the people and let them know. Absolutely. Hey, we got to go over here. I'm going to have Dave. This is this is cat stuff over here, right? No, nope, more oh, dogs. Oh, still dogs? Yeah. Oh, the cat stuff's down one more. Cat's down one more. You'd figure I've been here for 20 years. I know all of this. Cat stuff, okay? Now, I've got my little kitty cats now and okay. they're my my favorite things in the whole world. But uh, I, I think you, you have to be so careful. I'm going to move here so I'm in there. You have to be uh, so careful nowadays with what you're feeding your cats because they can get sick so quick. Yeah. And, and that's why, you know, like these pearl plants and, and stuff like this, I know. But I, I feed my cats uh, a, a th a wet food and then I mix in dry food with it. That's uh, good. And they seem pretty happy with that. Well, cats need a little extra um, water in their diet, so the canned food kind of offers that for them. Because they don't drink water, really. I mean, no, it's not I their mean, big they're, thing. They're not ones to sit. If you ever notice that your cat kind of wants to get in the sink, yeah. they like moving fresh, clean water. Oh. So they're not opposed to drinking out of a bowl, but nine times out of ten, they want fresh water. So that's a lot of the reason why they don't get that in their hey. diet. Benches Greenhouse and Nursery in Elmore, Ohio is a proud sponsor of Northwest Ohio Athletics. Our spacious greenhouse area has what you need for your outdoor beautification projects. With great specials and those hard to find plants, shrubs and trees, Benches Greenhouse and Nursery takes the guesswork out of planning and maintaining your favorite garden and more. Benches Greenhouse and Nursery. Call them today 419-862-3596. Do you ever drive around the neighborhoods just to look at the houses? I like spotting the ones that have been around the longest because they remind me of the amazing legacy I'm part of. Hi, I'm Marty Sutter, president of Genoa Bank. For over 110 years, our bank has helped families buy and build their homes. And all that time, one thing hasn't changed. At Genoa Bank, we believe that when we put the mortgage needs first, the rest takes care of itself. Genoa Bank, taking your banking needs personally. Mike Jamison and Jamison's Mobile Music would like to talk to you about your entertainment needs for your upcoming wedding or special event. For over 25 years, Mike has made wonderful memories one event at a time. Professional sound and lighting and video for your special event. Call us today for an affordable package for your special day. 419-514-1302. Jamison's Mobile Music and Video. Cleaning your gutters can be dangerous. Take it from Marty. For 30 years, I've been climbing up that ladder, cleaning out those gutters. One time, I leaned the ladder up there, and the feet were on the deck. The deck was a little wet. Next thing I know, the ladder kicks out, and I'm hanging by the gutter, and I start yelling for help. After that occurrence, I called Gutter Helmet. Call Gutter Helmet for an estimate. 419-475-0000. Get Gutter Helmet today, and you'll never clean your gutters again. Keeping you out of the gutter. Well, folks, we're here with Kathy from Danar's Automotive. Kathy, uh, <laughs> it's spring. The first time this show is going to air, but uh, potholes. That's all i got to say. I know. It's terrible. I know. It's a very expensive. Um, it can cause very much damage to your car. It's expensive fix. It can be an expensive fix. So we're going to talk a little bit about that. It can damage your tires, your rims, your suspension, exhaust, maybe even some body parts if you have a low rider car. And, and I mean, your insurance isn't going to cover this nine times out of ten. Well, there are some insurance companies that will cover damage from potholes, but mm -hmm. 
for the most part, if you have a $500 deductible and it does $600 damage, you're not yeah. going to turn it in. So it, it's just a mess out there. Folks, you got to be careful driving. I, I mean, I-75, it's just, it's unbelievable. Right. It's unbelievable. And they just rebuilt this thing. What's going on? I know. And, and people, you know, you're, you're just driving along. You don't think about it. And man, boom, you get hit. And uh, the, one of the cars that you're working on right here, it's the back wheels that actually yes. had the problem. It's a, it, this car's going to get rear struts. But when I was doing a little research, it kind of blew my mind. It said that um, in one year, Americans spend $300 billion on their vehicles. Um, with damage that's caused by potholes, it averages out about $300 a car, which, you know, that makes sense. It blows sure. one tire and one wheel, boom, yeah, there's your $300. So. Well, you know, you got a, you got a rim sitting yeah, here. Yeah, this was one ready. of them. Now, I mean, at this point, I mean, that's done, right? Oh, yeah, we had to provide a new wheel for them. That's done. There um, and go. they also got a new tire. So, I mean, you can see, um, these, this is an alloy wheel, which is made out of aluminum, typically softer than steel. Right. So it doesn't take much impact to do that damage. Oh, now, really steel good. wheels, sometimes they get bent. We may be able to straighten it out, or we may just have to replace it also. But awesome. you can see that's uh, not usable anymore. All right, Kathy, they, they, uh, they got the old one out. Yep. And, uh, there's the old strut, and we can, we can look a little closer at that and see that um, looks like there's some oil residue right there on the springs and you know it's just old rusty not doing its job typically we like to see struts replaced every 50,000 miles okay so this car i think is in the hundreds well overdue for a set of new well, set no of struts because no one thinks about the rear stuff well they don't and you know struts is what actually holds your vehicle to the ground right. exactly so it helps maintain you know a stable ride and keeps your wheels held close to the ground so it's not bouncing you know, if you've seen your tires where they get all chopped and cupped, sure. that's a direct result of bad struts or now, shocks. Now, with this new one that they're putting in mm -hmm. here now, uh, obviously, uh, it's going to be a whole new ride for them, won't it? It will be. And the cool thing about, um, like, replacing a strut this way is it's a whole unit. So you're getting a new coil spring, you're getting a new mounting plate, and then, of course, the strut insert. So it's a much better um, job when you when you can replace it as a unit itself. Wow, big show this week, real yeah. real one. You let me sit down because you know I'm you know I'm <laughs> I'm, I'm, an, I'm an invalid now, folks. So <laughs> these are a couple more weeks. I know you got some good specials and everything. We here. do, we do. We um, we always have good specials, but right now Monroe's uh, shocks and struts, you can buy um, three get the fourth one free, and also they have a deal with their quick struts and some other. Um, products where you get $50 or $75 back in the form of a Visa card. Oh, so wow. great time to do that. Um, we have some tire specials going on and always with our tires when you buy a set of four tires you get a discount on your alignment. So great time to get your suspension checked, yes. get your you know tires looked at, struts, and um, avoid the potholes. Oh yeah. There you go. That's what you need to do. You need to have get a pothole fixing machine. Right. You, you could be millionaires. Absolutely. I could see Dan up there driving a big old pothole yeah. fixing machine. Right, right. It would be him. He would love that. I know he would. I know he would. But thanks for being a part of Let's Fix Her Up. And of course, it's all of our basketball games we do with the Toledo Sports Network and all of that. We're right smack in the middle of the sectionals right now. So uh, anything that we can do to help you out with your spring yeah, the things you want to get done for spring, uh, just give us a call, 419-514-1302. Uh, Kathy, have a nice one. Thank you. And, uh, folks, we'll see you next week right here on Let's And I promise, I'm not going to the hospital this week. I, I'll be here this week right on Let's Fix Her Up.